well. 2020 just in our year, is it? I hope you guys are safe and having a good week. Um, things have been so crazy with the coronavirus outbreak. Um, the schools here are starting to shut down. Just about a half an hour from us, the entire school district shut down. Um, we were just alerted that there was a child at a school in our district that did test positive for the virus. And um, now they're working on implementing e-learning so all the kids can be taken out of school and do school from home. There's a ton of colleges that have shut down. It has shut down the NHL, the NBA, international flights. You can't come back to the U.S. I mean, it's there's a lot going on. But regardless, we're going to open some Pokemon cards today. So I hope you guys are ready for some excitement because today's the day. This monkey just climbed into my lap. What are you doing, little monkey? Do you want to be in the video? He says I'm handsome. I should be able to stay. All right, guys, welcome back. Today, we are going to be opening some VMAX Rising Django. Can I help you? If you want to be in the video, I have to be able to talk, okay? You can't put your face in my mouth. That's rude. All right, so today we're gonna be opening some V Max Rising. Now this is what will be Rebel Clash here in the United States. Now I don't think that this is the entire set of Rebel Clash. I think that the Japanese Rebellion Clash plus V Max will comprise most of our cards for Rebel Clash. I don't think it's, um, I don't think Rebel Clash is gonna be so small for us. It is a pretty small set from what I've seen on the Poke Collector app. So, um, I don't know. I'm gonna have to Google it for you guys. But if this is your first time here on the channel, first of all, welcome. I'm Wizard of Kanto and I post Pokemon pack openings on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you enjoy playing the Pokemon trading card game online, make sure you are smashing that subscribe button and ringing the bell so you are notified when I post new videos because I give away code cards in all my videos. I will always give you my code cards. However, sometimes my wife records with me. She keeps hers because she plays the trading card game online very religiously. So she needs some for her. Now, I don't know how to do the card trick. So we're going to learn together for this one. And yes, I opened the packs with scissors. Do you really want to watch me struggle and destroy all of these beautiful pack arts? Don't say yes. I'm not, no. You want me to struggle? Really? You want to watch me struggle for 10 minutes? Didn't think so. Didn't think so. All right, we've got Shuckle, Barbarical, Applin, <laughs> Farfetch'd, and, uh, oh my goodness, Impidimp. <laughs> I get so mixed up when the names are in Japanese. All right, so I don't know which one is rare, which one is uh, common or uncommon. Oh wait. There's a C. Hmm. So I don't know what spot the rare would be in. I'm going to look that up for the next time. So we can do the card trick properly. Or I guess I'll just figure it out after we open a couple packs if we pull something. All right. Ooh, wow. Dragapult. Oh, God. Please tell me that's Dragapult. Oh, uh, guys. Don't hate me. Binacle. Heliolisk. <gasps> Inteleon V. This is an amazing card. I absolutely love it. First move is Snipe Shot, I think. No, that's the promo. Never mind. I don't know what this first move is going to be. But I like the first move. It looks like it's, it is the same, though. Um, you can do 40 damage. I see the 40 in there because the 4 and the 0 are definitely in the numbers that I'm used to reading. So you can do 40 damage to any of your opponent's Pokemon, which is pretty nice. And a double colorless energy. Oh! <gasps> Double colorless is back in standard rotation! <gasps> That's so exciting. Oh my goodness. Hmm, my deck. My deck just got a lot easier to build. <laughs> All right, gotta get a sleeve, gotta get a sleeve. You guys, I'm losing my mind. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm never prepared. I don't know why I say that every time, but. <laughs> I hope everybody's having a wonderful week. I think I've already said that, but regardless, happy Friday. 
Um, I was supposed to be going to Florida this weekend to the um, Murakami Art Museum in Delray uh, to see Mitsuhiro Arita Shokologo. Um, he was doing uh, an art event and he was also gonna sign some stuff for people, but with the current state of the happenings, that's just not going to happen. Um, luckily I did get a refundable hotel and everything, so that's taken care of, and I'm pretty sure um, all I have to do is pay a small fee for to get my airline miles back that I used for the flight, but it's just at this point not safe, and we'd rather be, woo, curse a very, very nice. We'd rather be safe than sorry, um, and because I do still want to go to Collective Con. I really need to make sure that I'm well enough to go. And as of yesterday, I found out that I was in contact with somebody that was in contact with someone that has the virus. So I don't, I don't know if I have it and I don't want to risk infecting a whole bunch of people if I do have it. Um, all right. What is this? Fourth pack? One, two, wait. Oh, five. Fifth pack. Fifth pack. We've got a Nympidimp. A baby Cursula. What is Curs? It's just Cursula, right? Right? I don't know. Cor Galarian Corsula? And then Cursula? Oh my goodness. Alright, we've got Metapod. Toxtricity. This is a card that I would like a jumbo of, or, you know, a B Max or something. Just, you know, just staying. And we've got a Zatu. All right, let's get into another one of these. There are no codes in the Japanese pack, so that is not me being stingy. You guys are seeing me snip them open. There are no code cards, so that's uh, that's not my fault. I'm terribly sorry I don't have any to give you guys. Volpix, Baby Bear Scuda, Bronzor, <gasps> Intellion VMAX, oh, look at him. Oh, he's just like a model. What's that? Um, uh, he's America's Next Top Model, guys. Look, oh man. What a fabulous boy. We got both. We got the V. We got the VMAX. Look at, oh my goodness. We're getting the luck today. It's a shame Nikki's not here. Uh, me, 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 me. Well, let me know down in the comments below if you have opened any of this set. And if so, which cards are you looking forward to most in the English set? Or if you haven't opened it, just let me know what cards you are hoping they put in the English set. We've got a Aegislash. Aegislash is one of my favorite Pokemon as well. He is a nifty boy. I enjoy, um, I enjoy him. He's nice. We've got our Buff Grass Man, Bunnelby, Honedge, Farfetch'd. And Surfet, very nice, hollow rare. Seems that there are only 70 cards in this set. So I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say that this is a two-part set, much like the Sword and Shield base set from Japan. And that we will be getting all of it in one set. But I could be wrong. Still, I'm usually wrong. All right, we've got Barbarical again, Catapie, Mr. Rhyme, Galarian Mime, eh, meh, 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 Charge Bug, <laughs> and another Aegislash. Can we get another pull? We only have two packs left. We did open some of these on stream, uh, just an Instagram Live, and then this is just my half of the booster box. Nikki has her half still to open as well. So it could be that all of the pulls are over there. But we'll, we will see. Oh, there's Mr. Rhyme. Okay, so that was Galarian Mr. Mime. I'm just losing my mind. Bronzor, Magikarp, Dreepy, and Skyla. I, I'm not used to this five card madness. I just want to keep making the motion and it, there's no motion left to make after the fifth card. A very beautiful nine tails card. I think I saw something shiny back there. Volpix, very, very nice. Snover, Bunnelby, and what the heck is your name? Duraludon. Dura mm -hmm. Duraludon? Mm -hmm. yeah. It's a hollow. 
We got quite a few pulls since you are not guaranteed anything, not even a rare, in Japanese packs. We opened, let's see how many we opened. Count them with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven packs. Let me get the trash out of the way. I made a mess. We got three hollows, a full art. Is this a full art? Technically? I don't know. I don't think there's... Eh. A VMAX and a V. It's going to be a little bit harder for me <laughs> to tell um, with Japanese sets because I don't know how they're supposed to be. There looks like there could be a little bit of texture on it, but I'm not sure that that would even be considered a full art here. Um, I think it's just a VMAX because in the sets that we have now, or the set we have now for Sword and Shield, there is a V and a VMAX, and the VMAX does look a little textured, but it is not considered a full art because the full arts always come at like the very end of the set for the English stir, which is, you know, a good way to tell what you have and what you don't by the number on the card. So we've got quite a bit of this set. The next time I open it, I will show you guys the binder because we are putting together a binder for this set as well. So you guys can see how far we've come. I usually post the pricing information for all of the polls. However, it is very hard to price um, Japanese cards. So um, your guess is just as good as mine on looking it up and I don't want to supply you with information um, because that would basically be me saying I'm confident in these numbers. And quite frankly, I am not. Um, there's a couple places that you can check. I know the po 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 collector app um, they do have the set list, and they usually, if you click on a card, it'll bring up the price of them, but I don't know if it does that for the Japanese cards, because the pricing does differ pretty drastically for most of the cards there. But, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, subscribe down below. I really appreciate it. In the description below, you'll find the links to my Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch. I stream on Twitch a couple times a week. I'm active on Instagram every single day. You can always hit me up on Instagram if you want to know if I'm streaming because I still don't have a set schedule. Just kind of going with the flow of things. Been playing a lot of PTCGO. You will also find in the description below my uh, username and I will also put it right here in case you want to add me and play because I am getting ready for the regionals event in May, the end of May, which is going to be here in Indiana, but it is going to be in Northern Indiana. I have been building and testing a bunch of different decks. So yeah, come play, come hang out, and I hope you guys have a safe and wonderful week, and I'll see you next time.